Welcome to Gaming Insects TV and welcome to another guide for Elden Ring on how to kill the Crystallian Duo optional boss. This one's very annoying. You fight both of them. One is ranged, the other one is melee. Spear is melee, ring blade is ranged. Who are we gonna kill first? We're gonna go for the spear. What do we need to do? Well, we need to make sure one of them is not able to hit us while this one is easy to punish. So the trick here is is to kind of um, keep your eye on both of them. And wait for the ring blade to do the little weird spinny move right there that she's doing right now off the screen. And then hit this one when this one has done its final attack animation for the spear thrust. That's kind of the strat here. Uh, right now we can't do it because, you know, he's still doing it. You know, and yeah, it's kind of rough. It's a very uh, kind of RNG dependent fight in a way. Uh, and I almost got hit there, but the guy was doing his spinny thing. And I did take a risk there. I almost got hit with that throw there, but we were okay. And, you know, this is a bad idea to hit him right now. But we're gonna probably hit him here. Yep. I did take a chance there. But once you stagger them and do a critical hit, this is how much health they take away. So I'm gonna hit her twice. I really took a chance here. I don't know how I managed to not get hit by that. Um, but, yeah. Luck was on my side, I guess. Sooner or later, guys, just keep practicing. You're gonna get it. If you really want to make this fight easier, you could probably use a summon or something. Because uh, it is available here and they can get distracted. But I don't I don't like using summons. It makes things too easy for me. I like the challenge. So, yeah. And I'm here to show you that it is possible. So, one is dead. And when it's only one of them, it's a lot easier. Simply because you don't have to worry about the... You know, someone hitting you off the screen. So, yeah. In here, you just wait for this. And then you dodge out of that one and that's it. It's uh, that easy. You know, just rinse and repeat. Once she gets staggered, or he, whoever it is, then you can um, do a critical hit and then finish them off with your uh, L2 Wild Strike weapon skill. Because, uh, yeah, it's kind of weird. I think the more you hit them, the more they break easier, so they take more damage because they're like crystals, right? Easier to crack them, I guess. That's the mechanic. And that's it. <clears throat> they're done for. And you do get an item called Somberstone Minus Bell Bearing. So if you are looking for all the trophies, all the items, that's how you do it. Thank you guys for my checking this out. I hope you like it, and if, if you did, if it did help you out, like and subscribe, and I will be seeing you soon for more Elden Ring Guides. Peace out, and have a good one.